In today's video, we will cover the differences between the studio version and the free version of DaVinci Resolve for your iPad. And I have to say, all of the credit goes to one person here from the community of the DaVinci Resolve family. And that is Chris Borgert. Thank you. He was sitting last night there because he has two iPads, one with the studio version and one with the free version. And he looked at each of the pages, or at least the ones that are available right now, that's the cut page and the color page. And he looked at each function, each effect, and made a document for us. So if we take a look at my iPad, you will see the first document, for example, is the DaVinci Resolve for iPad cut page. So in this document, he was writing down all of the commands, like the types of functions that we have. And then we see if it's free, yes, or is it no, only in the studio version available. And you can basically go through all of those. This is a complete list now for the cut page. And we have the same document also for the color page. I will make it very simple. Here in the description, I have a link to both of those documents. This is available for everyone out there. So if you want to have this, go to the description. And thank you again, Chris. You are amazing. And this, is help this will be so much helpful for so many people. So if you are interested in the studio version, you can check out now this document and look which functions you actually need. Are the functions important to you or not? And make a decision based on that list. If you found this video helpful, hit like, subscribe, dingle dingle the bang bang gong, and I'm Daniel. We we'll see us in the next video. Bye.